Tonight, tributes continue to pour in for Daisy Coleman. She's the Missouri woman who became an advocate for sexual assault victims after surviving her own attack. Tonight, mourners held a vigil to remember the young woman and what she overcame. KCTV 5's Emily Rittman has the story. People around the world knew her as Daisy Coleman. Many of her friends called her cat. Tonight, her mom and those close friends gathered in Loose Park to remember her. You guys want to hold hands? Daisy Coleman's friends sat in a circle Friday night sharing stories about the 23 year old. Her mother, Melinda, who held the hands of her daughter's friends, said Daisy was an old soul from the moment she was born. She always fought for what she thought was right. Daisy shared her story of surviving sexual assault at just 14 years old in her small town in Maryville, Missouri in 2012. The 2016 documentary, Audrey and Daisy, focused on the intense online and in-person bullying and backlash she overcame for reporting the assault. The ones that truly knew her and like, knew how special she truly was and she's not just some rape survivor. She's way more than that. Many in the group shared how Daisy helped them when they were experiencing trauma or pain. Her mother said Daisy wanted the documentary to be about every survivor and not just herself. Anyone that truly like knew Daisy knew that she was a very strong woman. Like she had so much trauma in her life and even then she would take on somebody else's like trauma just to help them. She'd take on anybody's battles just to make them happy over her own self. Our biggest question is always why. Friends say Daisy experienced a lot of trauma in her 23 years, but spent those years saving others as an advocate and loyal friend. It really hurts because we all wish she was still here. Emily Rittman, KCTV5 News. There is help available for those who need it. The number for the Suicide Prevention Lifeline is 1-800-273-TALK. It's free and confidential support available 24-7.